What's going on YouTube and in this video um, this is going to be like a revised review of the Tuttle Beijing 4 video. Um, this is the Tuttle Beijing 4 right here and uh, it's being boosted right now in this process. I'm just waiting for the rubber to flatten out. So um, in my last review uh, I looked over it and it's kind of inaccurate so now I have a good uh, better like review. Now attackiness on this um i was actually in a, it was inaccurate in my last review the tackiness is uh it's tackier it's a it's about it's like medium tacky but uh, it's like medium tacky but a little bit less than that medium tacky it's like um if any of you have had uh butterfly tenergy 64 fx uh this is uh, actually uh, tackier than that rubber and it's less tacky than Hurricane 3, so it's, it, it's kind of in the middle. I would say it's slightly towards more towards the Butterfly 10 Energy 64 FX, but this is tackier than that. It's a little bit like grippier, but um, and the sponge is super super soft, and um, spin it has good spin because it has a soft sponge for the ball to dig into the rubber, and gives a good catapult effect. It's not super fast. It's actually quite slow, but it, it's it's good. It gets the job done. And um, control it has good control. It's very versatile. It's easy to chop with. It's easy to attack with. It's actually an all-around rubber, but it's probably more for defense, defensive since it has a soft sponge and it handles well in incoming spin. Now, should you boost this rubber? I've tested this rubber boosted and actually it, it improves quite a bit. So boosting basically stretches the rubber. So it used to be slow, but once you boost the rubber, it's actually quite relatively fast. Um, it, it bumped from like a six to like an eight point five. It, it's um, it it's just um, boosting this rubber is actually very beneficial. It, it's a good rubber to boost because it in every um, category. It performs better and has better control, more speed, more spin, um, and a much better catapult. It's more springy after you boost it. And I boosted it with um, Falco Long Term Booster, and uh, it's a good rubber, or it's a good booster. And this rubber definitely performs much better boosted than it not boosted, if that makes sense. So that's pretty much it, the revised review of the title Beijing 4. I'll see you later, YouTube. Peace.